Hey everyone, Deadly Deity here. Welcome to part two of uh, my Pokemon Super Mystery Dungeon Let's Play slash playthrough. Um, if you like this content, please do consider giving it a thumbs up and subbing below. Um, we're basically going to the Drill Burn Mine. Um, since I didn't kill anything in basically like the second dungeon when we were trying to save Gumi, um, I actually went to the Drill Burn Mine here. And wait, what floor are we? This is the first floor. Um, so I didn't kill anyone there. Um, and so I actually went to this dungeon unrecorded uh, just to level up a little bit and kind of um, make sure that we're good and so that's why I guess if you you know if you watch my other one I'm level I was level 5 there now I'm level 7 here mm -hmm. but it should just be fine oh my god I got hit there come on Bulbasaur do more damage there you go, level 7. Ooh, it can learn a new move. Grass. Growl. Yeah, we'll forget Growl. Good. Obviously, I'd want it to do Leech, man. Let's pick up our items here. Tiny Reviver Seed, alright. We're gonna hit him with a water gun. Should be super effective, we'll just tackle him. Look at that, Bulbasaur didn't do any damage here. Um, I'm still, the controls are still a little difficult for me. Oh, that, that man's, what? I, I missed. Oh no, oh no, 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 what do I do here? I need to B and then we'll switch, right? There we go. Perfect. Do you guys have trouble doing the dribble coal mine? And uh, did you guys happen to kill anyone like um in the second dungeon when you're trying to save Gumi or not? Nah? I'm just curious since I thought that all the enemies didn't take damage from me basically, and so I kind of. Thought it was just a dungeon of, you know, not necessarily kill people, but, um, kind of more so. Hold on, I got a text message, check it out. Okay. Uh, oh, free hit on this guy. Oh, man. I need to restore my PP. Pee -pee. Not enough moves, man. I should probably go all the way down here. Where's Bulbasaur? Hey, buddy. I'm gonna let him do his thing. <coughs> I don't need to kind of micromanage this right now, but I do want to be able to get different Pokemon later on. Oh, the. Oh, Bulbasaur found it. See? See, guys? Doing, doing it separate can help you find things, so. Maybe, maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll tell him to just do whatever he wants. Actually, that's probably a bad idea. Oh, no. Oh, no. This guy's a fire. We're gonna hit him with a water gun. And I missed, so that's fantastic. Oh, no. My attack went down. I want to hit the fire guy. Why did I miss? Do I have any items? Oh my goodness, this is... Okay. Great. Mmm... Okay, good. Thanks for saving me there, Bulbasaur. Oh! HP is low. Eat an Oran Berry. I don't have an Oran Berry, bro. Okay, stats return normal. We got an apple. That's for the belly, though. Hopefully we don't encounter anyone here. Yeah, you know, I think the midpoint, there's like a midpoint, um, 
stair midpoint level here and that basically I think refreshes your I, don't, I would not like to go on just yet I would like to face this guy and hit him with the water gun water gun was upgraded come on slap him good job Hey, we're level 8. Okay, great. I'm going on, yes. We're level 8, man. I think... It's either this level or 5. Okay, well, it's level 5, I guess. Okay. Well, uh... Oof. Oh no. Come on. Well, he does a lot of damage. Yeah, I don't think we want to fight the other guy right now. At this moment in time, probably not a good idea. Don't have anything to restore PP. Pee -pee. It's weird, my, uh, when I was doing this unrecorded in the camera, it was actually way better. Oh no. Growling at me, man. Mm -hmm. Here we go, tackle. Thank you, Bulbasaur, for putting, pulling through that one. Return to normal. Okay, tiny reviver seed. Our belly is a. Uh... Why didn't Bulbasaur go through that tile? Come on. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right. No, you got it, Bulbasaur. Good man. Level 8 Bulbasaur, yeah. Pick up that apple. Picked up 38 gold? Wow, this guy. Dude, let's not fight that man. No, 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 no. Let's not fight that man. Let's go all the way down here. It's, it's gotta be down here, right? My goodness, this guy's still chasing us. Talk about ridiculous. No, Bulbasaur! Stop it! Is there anything you can kill him? There we go. Great job. <coughs> okay, here, here's where they talk, blah, blah, blah. And I think I can grab some stuff here. Items. I want to withdraw items. So let's get um, an elixir. Okay. Let's also get some Oran Berries. Okay, that's good. Petrify Orb to save us. Um, a Warp Wand. Uh, what do we want? Petrify Wand is probably good. Alright, we're going in. No one is allowed in, so why? Would you like to go on in? Yes. I ah, got wibble. I actually don't know if that's how they sound, but let's let's just work with that for now. Okay, this man is over here. See, we. Oh, the water gun doesn't go that far. It goes what two tiles? Come on. So many of these Pokemon like just debuff. It's kind of annoying to be honest. Just chill, man. You really gotta debuff me? Uh oh, it's Geo Dude. It's my boy, dude. Geo Dude. Hey, come on, get closer. Get closer. He's just gonna do all these buffs and stuff. 
Hey, well, hope that hope you enjoy that, Geo dude. Let's go on. A drill burr coal mine. Oh, confused one. Yes. And we get an elixir. Nice. Ooh. I'm gonna use tackle. I think that'll level up. Alright. Does it? Mm, the move failed, lol. So you can't do that. Oh, no, Geodude. Chill, fam. I don't think Geodude actually attacks. Well, he attacks, but. Bulbasaur, get out of there. Bulbasaur's playing a dangerous game, man. Aaron just can use Harden. Rouse, Barry, there's one item up here. Blast Seed. Alright, we're gonna Blast Seed this other guy. 7 4, we've gotta be by the boss, right? It's a very interesting. Geodude picked up an apple. Alright, Cubone. Probably shouldn't have used Water Gun for the second attack. Oh well. Oh. Okay. Harden's not gonna do much. Come on. Get out of here. Right, guys, get out of here. Hmm. Looks like we've ended up in the dark. Grr. Silly, deadly deity. Is that your tummy rumbling? Grr. Huh, that's a pretty odd sound for a stomach to make, though. Grr, exactly. What you hear is not a stomach rumble. Whoa, your stomach can even do voices. Deadly deity, you are full of surprises. As a stomach with a verbal. Burble, huh? What? Were you listening? That one that making noises me. I'm the one growling at you. Who is this guy? War. My name is Gabite. And this is my territory. And you, what are you kids? It doesn't matter even if you are, I'm not going to go easy on you. I'll treat you like any other thieving thieves that come to swipe my treasure. Huh, thieves? We wouldn't do anything like that. Then why are you here? Um, what was it again? Oh yeah, the red stones. We came here to pick up some red stones. Hey, tell me, have you seen any red stones lying, ar lying around down here? Red stones, you say? Those red stones are my treasure. Most pre my most precious jewels. What? I knew you'd come and sell them, you little thieves. No, we come to my drill burr. Come, my drill burr compatriots. Oh no. It's time to fulfill your promise and r rout these thieves. Let the battle begin. Wibble! How about that? See, fighting isn't really our forte, so wibble. Sorry, wibble. Oh, okay, well, it's just 2v1. We can handle this one, right? Never mind. I do not intend to forgive you, thieves. Even if you are a bunch of kids. Here I go. Let's see, hold on. What kind of touch screen display do we want in here? Um, I just want to see how much damage this guy does, but hopefully not too much. Oh, he, he's attacking Bulbasaur, so I'm chilling. Oh, wow, he's doing some damage. Let's do a Confuse Wand. There we go. Can he use Dig? 
Oh, I didn't know that could do damage. Do not. Bulbasaur, you're taking some damage, bro. Um, we'll give him an Orin Berry. Give it to Bulbasaur. Oh no, he's still taking some damage. I got like a blast seed or something. Oh no. Okay, hold on. We we have like a blast seed here. Oh, it has to be right next to you. That's unfortunate. It's a lot of rookie mistakes here. But we're good. Good man. Arr, my treasure. I will not hand over my treasure. No one said you had to. Like I said, we're not here to steal anything. But you are here for my red stones. But. But. I don't think. I think you should listen to them. Wibble. Where'd that voice come from? The drill burr. My drill burr compatriots. Mr. Gabite, sir. I think these children were telling you the truth the whole time. Wibble. I looked into these, this kid's eyes back at the entrance to the mine, and those eyes held not a shred of, not a shred of what? Not a shred of anything other than mischief. But still, I don't think they're thieves either, Wibble. We just really want to see what's at the end of the mine. Sure, we came for the red stones, but you said there's some kind of jewels? If there's something precious like that and important to you, then we don't need them. You really came just to look? Yeah. Well, it appears I may have made some rash assumptions. Erk, forgive me. I shouldn't have attacked, attacked you like that. It wasn't your fault. We're the ones who came sneaking into a place we aren't supposed to be after all. Yeah, that's what we said, Wibble. I'll make a special exception. So come with me. I'll show you what lies at the heart of this mine. Really? Is Gabite going to join me? Would you like to save your adventure? Yes. Oh, we're at two hours. Wow. You've had a great adventure today. I probably shouldn't rest. This is my special hideaway. My treasure chamber. Whoa, ho, ho. This is amazing. It's jam-packed with jewels. Deadly deity. Are you seeing this? Collecting jewels is a bit of a hobby for me, you see. I just kept picking up more and more, and before I knew it, I'd filled this whole room. For a while, no one noticed that I had such a hideaway in a place like this. But then one day, the drill bird came upon it, came upon it in their tunneling. And ever since, more and more Pokemon have come to steal my precious jewels. That's why the tunnel to this place was blocked off with entry forbidden. Anyone who managed to make it past the barriers, I've had to run off myself. We promised back then that we would fight off any thieves, but but when push, com push comes to shoves, we all get wibbly and wobbly and waddle away. I get it now. Well, now I feel really bad. We didn't mean to put you in a hard spot, but we did get to see the secrets hidden within the mine. We get to see this awesome treasure room. I, for one, am totally pumped, and I'd call this exploration a success. So thank you, Gabite, and drill you, Drillbird, too. And thanks to you, Deadly Deity. I love exploring and adventuring so much, so I really get into these kinds of things. But it was really thanks to you that I could make it this far, Deadly Deity. I got to do everything I wanted to here, so now let's go visit my favorite spot. Come on, Deadly Deity, let's head back to the village. Huh? Well, looky here if it ain't Deadly Deity. Hey, you two. Did you go in the into the block path like we told you to, huh? Yeah, we did. It was lots of fun. What? You did? Then where's your proof, huh? Did you bring us back the red stones? Nope. What? I can do that? After all, Gabite loves those stones. I didn't want to take something so precious to him and just stick him in my bag. It was way better just to get to see him and have that memory live on in me. 
<laughs> now they're confused. Come on, Deadly Deity, this way. Where is this guy leading me to, man? We're here, this is it. Deadly Deity, look over there. Whoa, I've never. Pretty great view, right? Uh -huh. You can look all over Serene Village from here. It's just, it's not just me who loves this view. Everyone in the village comes here. So I wanted to, you to see it too, Deadly Deity. It's nice here, isn't it? Phew, we sure worked hard today. It's so nice to be able to look up at the sky like this. Yeah, that's true. The breeze feels great too. It's such nice weather today. And our adventure was a success. It really is the best kind of day. Would you look at those towering great clouds over there? They're even taller than this big old tree, stretching all across the endless sky. But when the world looks up at them, even they look so tiny from so far away. It makes it sure makes you marvel at how big this world is. I want to be like those clouds. Like the clouds? I want to race away from this village and see all kinds of places like the clouds do. I want to meet all kinds of Pokemon and have all kinds of wild adventures. That's why I want to go to Lively Town and join the Expedition Society. When I'm part of the Expedition Society, someday I want to a, complete a map of this world. That's my dream. Wow, so Bulbasaur has a dream. Seems like a pretty good dream too. I could get behind a dream like that, but I can't. I can't do it. What? They don't let kids join the Expedition Society. Even if they did, everyone says it's too dangerous to leave the village. Can't do this, can't do that. That's all they ever say. Why are grown-ups always like that? They gang up on us kids and tell us the way things are supposed to be. But then, if we listen to them, we'd never get to do anything. Even a bit, even a little bit reckless. Well, yeah, if you try doing something reckless, I guess they would step in. But it doesn't matter. I still won't give up. I'll never give up on my dream. Never. Never, ever. I will never, ever give up. So, Deadly Deity. Huh? Deadly Deity? Oh, sheesh. I didn't know you were that tired. That adventure must have worn you out. Hey, Deadly Deity. You'll support my dream, right? Even if nobody else does? Oh, you just nodded that. Just now I saw it. That means you will. Thanks, Deadly Deity. Alright, I'll give it my best shot. I'm definitely going for it. Just you watch me. I'll show everybody. Look at this nice town. Nice, nice town. It felt so good up on top of that hill that I dozed off. That was a pleasant place to hell with the big tree. The world of Pokemon has a lot of natural beauty. I get that it's a really nice place. But, but why am I here in this world? Why did I turn into a Pokemon? Those Behem worry me too. I wonder if I'll be okay just staying here. Th that thing. What could it have been? This, this feeling, for the first time, I feel true fear. Would you like to save your adventure? Yes. Save.
the next morning the next morning I guess we woke up oh there's a note hmm what's that a note from Nuzleaf Deadly Deity begins to read Nuzleaf's note Deadly Deity I sure am sorry about this something real urgent came up and I reckon I've got to head out right away I'll prob probably be away for a few days, so I'm afraid you'll have to you'll have the place all to yourself for a little while. I've left plenty of food, so you shouldn't have any worries on that front. But steer clear of the the behem, and don't you go skipping school. And looks like I'll be on on my own a while. Deadly Deity, good morning. That sounds like Bulbasaur. Oh, there you are, Deadly Deity. Good morning. I thought I'd come meet you since we live so close. Let's walk to school together. That's sweet. Haha, <laughs> it's kind of fun like this. Until you came, Deadly Deity. I used to always walk to school by myself. Good morning, Vice Principal. Good mor- Nah. It isn't the troublemaker. And you're not even late today. This is quite the turn of events. Morning, dearling. Oh, uh, yeah, morning. Well met, my friend Shelmet. Wow, you're just as annoying as ever. And we are not friends. Morning, Pinch. Whoa, stay back. You're irritating. I can hardly breathe with you all over me. It's hot enough these days without you hanging all over me. Guess he didn't like that. Uh -huh. Oh, good morning, Esper and Gumi. Save. Oh, ding dong again, all this stuff. Alright, class, that's the bell. Time for class to begin. Yes, sir. Today we'll be taking a little field trip. All right, a field trip. On field trips, our class visits a dungeon. Everybody goes on an adventure together. Attention please, no talking out of turn. You'd better listen to the instructions. Now let me see, Ahem. today we'll be visiting the school forest. We'll, we'll reach the school forest from this path We've left flags deep inside the forest. Bring one back and you pass today's lesson. How are we gonna form teams, Teach? Yeah, with Deadly Deity here now, we've got an extra Pokemon. Teams? Each team is made up of three Pokemon. It's no fun going alone, but having too many Pokemon on a team can get chaotic. Three Pokemon per team is pretty much the right number for exploring dungeons. I've already selected today's teams. Team 1 will be made up of Panchum, Shelmet, and Deerling. Team 2 will be made up of Gumi, Bulbasaur, and Deadly Deity. What? I'm with Panchum and Shelmet? Alright, we totally lucked out this time. Or we get to be with Deerling. Let's do this, Deerling. Oh, okay, I guess I've got no choice. It's part of the classwork, after all. And Mr. Parfetch, I am too. You'll be in charge of operations, Esper. Everyone will need to work together to clear this dungeon. That's why I'd like you to stay here and use your telepathy to support both teams. I understand. We're on the same team. This will be great. Gumi, I know that I'm always messing up and causing you trouble, but this time will be different. You'll see. Yeah, I hope so. All right then, children, shall we begin? The, team of, the theme of today's class will be mastering the use of items. I'll pass out boxes in just a moment. These bo items belong to the school. I will have you hand over any items you are carrying for the duration of the class. Don't worry though, your items will be kept safe in a deposit box. You'll need to use only the items provided in the box. I will give you. They will assist you in clearing the dungeon successfully. Please pick a representative from each team to coll come collect your item boxes. You don't mind if I go get the items, right? Right? 
Bulbasaur dropped off all your items with Mr. Farfetch'd. Bulbasaur picked up a box of school provided items in return. All right, boys and girls, do your best. We'll clear this dungeon in no time. There's no way we're losing the deadly deity in them after all. See ya, you bunch of slowpoke. Let's hurry up and get going to it. It's time to explore the school for us. Okay, I guess we're heading up in there. Yes. Okay, so we we got an enemy already. Oh, he picked up the apple. Okay, that's not cool, bro. No picking up the apple. Gumi used absorb. Interesting. Um. Wow. There's three of us. We can't kill this guy. Wow, Gumi jumped on that apple. I think. Eh, we'll probably be fine. Let's get this extra level here. Oh, I can do that. That's great. <coughs> I can shoot over Gumi. I didn't even know that. It's so great. Whoa. Level 9. Get that level, bruh. Okay, let's go. School Forest. Second floor. Adventure in, in it. In a tactics meeting, you'll decide what tactics your teammates will use and how your teammates will act. When you want to change a teammate's tactics, press X to open and select tactics meeting. Let's do that. I want to go to tactics meeting. Let's go together. Is Bulbasaur. Battle alongside the leader. Follow me, go after foes. Get away from here. Wait here. Interesting. Go the other way. Oh. I'm gonna use go the other way for Bulbasaur and you're gonna go let's go together with Gumi. They should be very interesting. What's roll call orb? Using it summons teammates on the floor. Great. Hope uh what's his name can handle? That would be great if we could figure out where to go faster. That guy looks like a turtle. Ooh. Let's hit him with assurance. Oh, Bulbasaur. You're very low, man. You're alone! Well, I hope he can handle it. He's two versus one. And he just died. What happens if I don't revive him? Oh no, Bulbasaur was defeated. Oh no, this is awkward. Let's face this guy and let's hit him with a Fury Cutter, I guess. The move failed. I guess you can't attack people from there, huh? Oh. Assurance was upgraded. Nice. 
picked up the orange berry, put it into the bag. Let's go on. Let's see if uh, Bulbasaur gets revived here. So it does not appear to be the case. That's not good. <laughs> That's actually pretty bad. Whoa. Okay, you blew me away. I'll hit you with that. Whoa, dude. Wait, he hit me that far? Oh, it's just two. Oh, no. Electric type guy. Roll call orb. Progress device. Stay away one. Oh no. Bulbasaur is dead. Bulbasaur is dead, guys. This is myself and Gumi. That's so bad. I don't know if we can 2v1 the boss or whatever it is. Whatever it might be for this dungeon. Oh, it's a Voltorb. Oh no. Wow, that's so strong actually. That assurance move. Um, well, I don't know what enemy this is, but me and foo. You should meditate. I mean, keep meditating, I guess. Not my problem, though. Um, Um, let's see if I can hit with a Fury Cutter. Uh-oh, uh-oh, too close to this man's. Too close to this man's, man. Okay. Oh, two items here. Good job, Gumi. There's an elixir here somewhere. It appears that they've picked it up though. Okay. Mm. Wait, Gumi, you left me, dude. Oh wait, there's an elixir over here. Looks like peanut butter. bag is too full to pick up. Okay. We'll eat an apple. Belly is full. Great. What orb is this? Um. Underfoot. Okay. What do we want here? Probably, oof. Uh, we don't need another orb. We'll just. Oh, there's Bulbasaur. Bzz, bzz. Hmm? What was that? Gumi, can you hear me? It's Esper. Thanks to her telepathy, Esper can communicate with others from a distance. Yeah, Esper, we can hear you. It seems like you're all doing fine. I'll keep in touch with you like this from time to time during your adventure. Great, we'll be listening for you. How are Pancham and those guys doing? Are they ahead of us? Yeah. I managed to reach them a little while ago. 
from what they said, it sounds like they're pretty far ahead of you, Bulbasaur. I see, good to know. But we're not going to lose to them. Let's pick up the pace, team. I'm not sure the pace can be picked up any higher than this. I just don't know if I can keep up. Don't worry, I know you can do it. It'll be no problem. You've got to get through this dungeon either way, so we might as well be first. You guys think the same thing, right? Let's go. School Forest, fifth floor. Oh no, Bulbasaur. Oh, my defense went down. Okay. Cool, dude. That was a Hippotile or whatever. Um, let's use like a radar orb or something. Okay, that's great, I guess, or not great. I don't know, it depends on how we want to look at it. Okay. Hit him with that tackle. So it's four attacks, I guess, is what we got going on for that one. I'll do assurance. Oh no, the move. Oh, you can't attack from there. It's so weird. Oh my lord, that damage. Yeah, that damage was a little ridiculous. What is this stuff right here? Oh, oops. I'll drink it on Yumi. Okay. Oh, I can't attack this guy from here. Ooh, seven health. Look at you, man. Go, Gumi. Here you go. Nice. Alright, let's go on and go on and. Okay, this is looking like about. This is gonna be a battle here. Oh my lord. Let's, let's get you out of here. <laughs> oh no, I have no health. I'm very low health. Oh, he's still hitting me. I want to see, uh, Yumi's moves. Menu. Gumi has... Oh, it's still pretty good. Gumi's doing better than me in terms of managing the PP. Um... One, two... Okay. Drop to zero. How did he manage to hit him with that? But then when I try to do stuff like that, it doesn't work. Apple. Oh, interesting. Okay. That's two, I think. Oh, no, I don't have. I 
Don't attack me. Uh oh. Oh no, these attack went up. I'm gonna drink this elixir. I'm go I'm we're leaving. We're leaving, stop attacking. Give this one to probably Gumi. Come on, Gumi, kill him. Why are you fighting? I guess tackle is the best move for that guy. Controls are so a lot difficult, guys, to be honest. Sorry, man. I'm a little slower than what you guys would expect. I don't really need that wand. Can go that way, I guess. an item over there. It's just an apple. I don't really care about that. It's just another wand. can't believe Bulbasaur died. That's the saddest part of this one. These dungeons are getting pretty hefty, man. <coughs> pretty hefty. Dude, we're already in the 8th floor, come on. Oh no. I'm gonna warp this guy away. Get out of here, goodbye. Mm, looks like he's good, I'll take that. Belly is one hundred. Here it is. Let's keep moving. Okay, Bulbasaur, where are you at, man? I think we're pretty far into the forest now. We still haven't reached a goal. Pan pant. Oh, look at that. It looks like the trees clear up up there. Let's go check it out. Pan pant. Oh, we lost Gumi. This place looks a bit different from the clearings we've been passing through. Maybe. Just maybe we're getting close to the goal. What? Where's Gumi? Huh? You're right. Gumi's not here. Where'd he wander off to? Bzz, bzz. This is Esper here. Can you hear me? We can hear you, Esper. Where are you guys now? I could be wrong, but I think we're pretty close to the goal. Really? Well, congratulations on that. It seems like you may have gotten there before Pancham and his team, huh? Really? Yes. The last time I contacted them, they didn't seem to be that far along yet. I guess you must have passed them by at some point or another. Really? Awesome. Alright. We might just win this one. Let's get going. Do not care about... but. Will Gumi really be all right alone? What? Oh, <laughs> I didn't even get to make a choice. So that's the goal, I guess. Deadly deity, look there. Do you think those could be the flags that Mr. Farfetch was talking about? There are two of them. So that means we really are the first team to make it here. That does seem to be true, but, but more importantly, what, Gumi? Oh yeah, he did wander off at some point, didn't he? 
it is a bit worrisome. Looks like we've arrived someplace new. Yeah, I got the feeling we've got to be close to those flags now. Let's pinch them and show them it. We've got to hurry and get that flag. Alright, we've cleared the dungeon first. Gah. Too bad for you guys. We were number one today. <laughs> So, you lost Gumi. Yeah. And? Where's Gumi now? Back in the dungeon some more, I guess. You're useless. What were you two thinking? I'm going to look for him right now. Bulbasaur's team cleared the dungeon first. Well done on that accomplishment. However, I cannot praise you for leaving a member of your team behind. Ugh. Ha ha ha. Let me tell you what I think about it. The, n the members of a team should look after one another. They work toward their goal together while caring for each other. And that might perhaps be even more important than clearing a dungeon, hmm? Ha ha ha. Yeah, that's enough staying around and moping. Gumi may still be lost in there. Why don't you go look for him? Yes, sir. Okay, we're going back in. I think now we have Deerling with us. Mr. Farfetch, I would like to go search as well. Oh. Then we get Esmer. Oi, I have no snickering for you from you. Yes, sir. What is this ding dong stuff, man? And so the school day ended and after school. I'm glad we finally found Gumi before anything happened to him. But but boy, I really messed things up again. All I could think about was being first to clear the dungeon, nothing else mattered. Hey Deadly Deity. Do you ever think I'm irritating? Huh? Painchim and Shalma are always telling me that I'm annoying or whatever. Today isn't the first time something like that, like this has happened. I feel like I just cause problems for everyone around me. So deadly deity. What do you think? Do you think I'm irritating too? Aaron, what should I say? Do you think that bubble store can be irritating? I don't think that. I don't think you are. That's not true. I'm just as much to blame for what happened to Gumi today. But still, it's true that you drag others into bad situations without thinking. And I guess I might end up with others feeling with others feeling troubled sometimes. So it might be better to try to keep other people's feelings in mind a bit more. Alright. Now I've got to get that idea across the Bulbasaur somehow. What? Really? I see. Yeah, you're right. I'm always rushing ahead on my own without thinking about other people. Erk! It looks like I may have made things even worse. I knew it. I just make messes for everyone and ruin everything. Sorry, Deadly Deity, for always being such a pain. I'll try to be more careful from now on. Oh dear, I didn't think my words would hit Bulbasaur quite so hard. It's so, it's hard to get your feelings across as others sometimes. Say, Mwahaha, Mwahaha. Here, two arise feelings of discontent. The power. I can feel it growing. Would you like to save your. Yeah, let's save, guys. Wow. This has been almost an hour. The next morning. Oh, the next morning, what do we do, guys? Morning, Deadly Deity. I'm gonna go on ahead to school today. I wouldn't want to irritate you by insisting we always go together. Oh my god, so petty. So, see you later, Deadly Deity. Seems like Bulbasaur is still hung up on what we were talking about yesterday. I guess. I'll just have to make my own way to school then. Okay, I guess we'll uh, 
Where should we go today? Let's go to the plaza. Let's deposit our items. So, can we deposit money? Should we talk to this guy? Wants to talk. Sunkern, boy, the enemy Pokemon you find in dungeons can be a bit rough. I know. The way they just attack you. Mm. Okay. By, by your level, blah, blah, blah. They're just talking. Let's see here. Where is the school? Is this a school? It doesn't look like the school. This is this the school? No, it doesn't look like the school. Whoa, where did we go? And mm, nothing in here. Wow, do we actually have free reign on what we can do here now? Hold on, let's go to the plaza. What is this gift shop? What is that guy? I put my heart into it. <coughs> oh, I think I may be a bit late, Pan Pan. Huh? Is that Bulbasaur? Hey, hey, did you hear that, Shelmet? This one here seriously wants to join the Expedition Society right now. I know, it's too funny. They don't let kids into the Expedition Society. Duh. Don't you know that? I know. But maybe I can do it if I try. That's what I believe. Maybe you can, you believe? Are you kidding me? Well, that's so funny about that, huh? What's so... Come on, everyone knows that it'd be impossible for a kid. And even if it weren't, there's no way you could get in. You're not even that good at exploring dungeons, are you? Ugh. Just look at the stunt you pulled yesterday. I mean, maybe someone like Esper, she's at least got some real skills. But you, yeah ha ha ha. <laughs> Poor Bulbasaur. Uh oh. Alright, class is now in session. Everyone to your seats. Bulbasaur? What is it? Did you not hear me say? Mumble, mumble. It doesn't matter what they say. I can do it. Yeah, I'm definitely going to do it. I won't ever give up. I'm going to achieve my dreams. I'll do it, and I'll show them all. Bulbasaur? Ah, what are you shouting about now? You have noticed that class has begun, hmm? Ha, 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 ha. What's this? Are you all right, child? You're beginning to worry me. And not for the first time. Sorry, Mr. Farfetch. I've just got some things on my mind. Yeah. I can't let myself get down. I won't lose heart. Ah, uh, silly Bulbasaur never knows when to give up. Well, I suppose that's all right then. In that case, let's begin another fun day of class. Yes, sir. Okay, let's save it. By the time third period rolled around. The period is beginning now. Today will be another dungeon outing. I, your illustrious vi Vice Principal Watchdog, will be leading this special class. Be sure that you obey my every direction without fail, especially you there. Huh, me? That's right, you, Bulbasaur. Once a troublemaker, always a troublemaker, that's what I say. So no trouble out of you today, you got that? Now let me divide you up into teams. The first team will be... Drumroll, please. Honorable Mitchell Watchdog Super Team. What? The team members will be... Esper, Deerling, and Deadly Deity. Let's do our best together, Esper and Deadly Deity. Just what I was thinking. 
And the next team, drum roll if you please. West French Paul Watchdog, excellent team. In this team we have Pantrium, Gumi, and Bulbasaur. Shelmet will set out today on today's exploration and simply observe. Next, as usual, I will be taking custody of, of any and all items you may be carrying. Your items will be secure, but blah blah blah. Okay, we're getting an item box. No way, I'm going. No, I called it first. Why don't you get out of my face then? Oh no, hey, break it up, you two. Didn't I just warn you, troublemaker? Pant, 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 pant. Why does this class always wear me out so much quicker than any of the others? My eyes aren't e are even twitching. Although they've always done that. I've just got to hurry and wrap this up. Now then, the topic of today's class is, in brief, Looplets and Emeralds. And hey, don't you kids know about them? Looplets, Emeralds. Am I saying that wrong, guys? Let me know in the comment below. Well, color me surprised. I'll explain this just once, so memorize everything I say. First, looplets. Why don't you all open the item boxes I handed out? Each box should have three looplets, one for each team member. Looplets are made to be worn on the body, so everyone in your team should take on one when you go into the dungeon. What about the dents on the side, Teach? Good observation, my young Shelmet. Those notches are made to hold emeralds. Emeralds? Exactly. Emeralds are very mysterious items that you can find scattered throughout dungeons. Find emeralds and fit them into your looplet. Quick, bang, boom. When you do, you'll find yourself reaping mysterious benefits. Wow, what kind of things do these emeralds do then? I can't wait to see. Me too, I want to see some. Hey, simple children, they're so easily impressed. I nearly let the class get away from me earlier, but now I'll just wrap things up before these scams burn me out even more. Oh, you would all you all would like to see some memoirs? You bet we do. Too bad, you'll never see any here. What? Emeralds disappear if you try to carry them outside of a dungeon. So you can never bring any to a regular place like this. Too bad for you all. However, I am your illustrious vice principal, a position far grander than a regular old teacher. So I will use my special abilities in the, this one time. To send an image of when Emmer looks like directly into your soft young minds. Here I go. Yarg. What is he doing, dude? Whoa. Uh, this is how Emmer's look and work. They're quite impressive, aren't they? All shiny and glittering. You pop them into your looplet and bam. They'll trigger beneficial effects for you during your adventures. There are any number of effects such as making your moves stronger. However, emeralds can exist outside of dungeons. When you return home from a dungeon, all of your emeralds will have disappeared. Well, I'll teach you really something. Yeah, I can really see the image in my mind. It's like you're a psychic type or something. Ho 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 ho! That's amazing. Really, VP Watchdog. Um, isn't it just a regular old drawing? What? It's not a psychic ability or anything like that. Ugh. Dude, Bulbasaur, seriously? How dim can you be? Man, I feel sorry for old Watchdog. Couldn't you have just played along? Oh, I get it now, gee, I'm sorry. At any rate, I'd say that was a swing and a miss for the VP. <laughs> Do you think he was trying to be funny? I thought it was playful and amusing. Well, perhaps it's still not too late. Let's all act like we're all on board now. A miss for me? But I, I never miss. Urgh, it can be. This is so embarrassing. Um, Mr. Washout, sir. That's enough out of you. I don't want another word out of any of you until you're in the forest. Just make your way to Glittering Mountain and bring back those flags. There are always tons of emeralds to be found on Glittering Mountain. Use them wisely. Now get out of here and conquer the dungeon. Yes, sir. Let's go. Yes, let's go to Glittering Mountain. Um, 
Don't know how many floors this is. Looplets. Okay. Looplet. Gib. Deadly deity. Looplet. Gib to Esper. Looplet. Gib to Deerling. Uh, maybe we should talk about tactics too, huh? Tactics meeting. Let's do. Uh, we're both all together. Okay, great. The item in the wrapper right is an emerald. Pick it up before the countdown ends, or it will shatter into tiny pieces. Use. What the? F what button is that? Holding R. Uh, let's give that to an emerald shattered. If you collect enough shattered emerald, one new emerald will form. But if you make good use of R, you may reach an emerald before it shatters. Okay, so we shattered one. Oh, pick these up, guys. Those are some emerald stuff. You got some an apple into the bag. Oh. Wow, those stupid emeralds. I'm gonna water gun this guy. Wow, all of us. Side beam, get wrecked, dude. Guard boost. That has gotta go on to me. Hit this guy first. Oh no, he hit me, man. Why is no one attacking? Help, maybe? I'm gonna run away. Come on, guys. Attack this guy. What's happening? Wow, dude. Um, let's attack this guy. Wow, like half my moves are weak here. Ridiculous. Picked up the apple and put it into the bag. <coughs> so, Emeras, huh? When you want to save in a dungeon, use a progress device. You can save during your adventure, and next time you can start off from where you left off. That's sick. Um, Fury Cutter. Nice. Great. I'm just gonna go up here. We are gonna go on, friends. Oh uh, no, this man, why did he do that? That side beam is so strong. <coughs> oh my goodness. That missed. Wow, dude, side beam. Um, side beam, come on. One of them picked up a Emer Emera or whatever. What's it called? Oh, critical hit. Well, I send him regularly. What's a trap bust or? Oh, hitting me, huh? 
Voilà. 7. What does this do? We'll give a... Uh, the barrage. Wait, what does the barrage do? Your moves can hit multiple times, apparently. I am reading that from another source, by the way, so... Oof. I feel like I'm, uh... I'm getting to the... Floor is a little bit too fast here. Power boost X. There we go. Esper, pick that up. Swap. Swap it with an apple. And then we'll, we'll eat the apple. Yeah, you give me that money. That's so crazy, dude. If you're like in a field trip and you find money, it's yours, man. Uh, we're finding the stuff too fast. What other items do we need here? Pounce wand. Breaks all traps on one floor. Super critical. Oh, I'm all about these emeralds. That's cool. Oh, we got it. I'll get a super critical, why not? Clutch performer. What does this one do? Oh man. Very interesting. So I have a full. Let's see. I think I'm okay. Esper's. Do oh, Esper's side beam is getting a little low. And that move is clutch, so we definitely want that. What is this? I'll eat it. Oh, max HP increases, I guess. Interesting. No, we missed where I get side beam. Side beam, friends, come on. And we're gonna switch. We're gonna switch out. Oh, goodbye. Oh, that thing broke. Excessive force. Oh no. <coughs> um, what do we want here? Come on, side beam. Hit it better. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mankey. Power boost X set. 
I don't know if they stack, so I'm just gonna not pick that up. Nothing in there. Wow, that was actually 100% of the dungeon. Super critical. Okay. That is fine. This is actually a really big dead end. Wow, that's crazy. Guard boost. Uh, no. Dude, side beam, man. I want, uh, oh, Fury Cutter is super effective. Oh, no. Oh my goodness, wrong place. Oh no, oh no, oh no. These corridors, man. There we go, that's what we like. Orenberry, I'll eat it. Max HP increased. Only this adventure only. Bruh, how many floors is this glittering mountain, man? Should probably swap this out with <coughs> a plain seed. Do we want to swap this with something? Uh, I think everything is good, man. If you guys haven't played, by the way, like games like these are super interesting to me because I um, I used to play Azure Azure Dreams or something I believe that's what it was called um, and that was uh, basically from the PlayStation 1 Emma Up Orb what does it do? wait hold on info ooh that's sick. Another Emra wand expert. What does this do? Okay. Wand expert. No, move failed. Come on, come at me. Oh, I should use Fury Cutter. Esper. Oh, there it is. Let's go on. Emeralds are pretty cool, though. Pretty cool. We climb pretty high up. Hmm, what's the matter, Esper? This way. Is this... Maybe this is the peak of Glittering Mountain? 
Look over there. Those are the flags, and there are two of them, which means we appear to be the first to have arrived. And we've cleared the dungeon. Come on, let's hurry back. Impressive, congratulations. Team Super Honorable Master Watchdog. Or was it Excellent Team Vice Principal Watchdog? Oh, never mind. Congratulations all around. Good job, dearly Esper Deadly Deity. While, on the other hand, why is everything always my fault, huh? Because you're always so annoying. I can't focus at all when you're around being such a pain all the time. And on top of that, you're always rushing off into dangerous places. Isn't that what it means to have an adventure? All it means is we never actually clear the stupid dungeon. My, my. Indeed, you'll never clear a dungeon with that kind of terrible teamwork. Hold on a second, are those two, are they even listening to me? I hate this part of my job. Why do problem children have to be so problematic? Everyone else, please take care that you don't end up like those two. I will be dealing out extra assignments to both of them later. For everyone else, class is dismissed. Off on your way. After school that day. Goodbye, Miss Adino. Yes, goodbye for today. Have a safe trip home. Miss Adina, I hope you'll be giving me some real TLC next time I faint in the dungeon. Now, now, I'll have none of that cheek from you. Unless you'd like me to drop you off in a really frightening dungeon. Huh? But if it was just me and you going... Hehe. Hey, stop that. Hey, deadly deity. Are you walking home alone? Where's Bulbasaur? We're off alone again, I see. Well, then you'll just have to walk together with us. But why hasn't Bulbasaur been coming together with you anymore? You don't come to school together. You didn't come to school this morning either. Until now, I thought the two of you... One second. Um... I thought the two of you had been getting along so well. Huh? Bulbasaur and you had a talk? And you suggested that Bulbasaur might be a bit annoying? Hmm. So that's it. Bulbasaur is usually quick to recover from disappointments, but... Perhaps this time... Sung a little too much? But that doesn't mean you, what you said was wrong, Deadly Deity. You had to be honest, after all. It's true that Bulbasaur tends to drag everyone into trouble more often than not. Hmm, what is it? You want to know how we feel about Bulbasaur? It's not like I don't like Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur is, is always cheerful. And fun to be around. So I don't dislike Bulbasaur really, but... I have ended up in dangerous situations because of Bulbasaur's adventures. Dangerous situations? Well, you know how Bulbasaur will walk right into places that even adults avoid. Bulbasaur calls it an adventure and drags others in. It gets to be a bit much. Gumi has gotten a little tired of all that. And I don't hate Bulbasaur or anything. But there is a limit on how reckless one can be. Sometimes I just have to say no. I see. I didn't really notice when I first arrived here in this world, but Bulbasaur isn't actually close to all the other kids. Save. Harmony Scarves. The next morning. So this is the next morning guys, I think. I'm gonna be cutting it off around here. Let's save our adventure. Save. Save completed. 
Alright, um, thanks for watching. If you liked it, please do consider giving it a thumbs up and subbing below. Otherwise, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.